I don't live at the rectory at the parish. I live at Aquinas House, which is where our campus ministry center is. So Father Timothy, who's our chaplain, lives like above the shop, but I don't. So I have this very clear, like when I go home, like I go home. And <laughs> when the workday is over, I don't answer emails and I don't uh, answer text messages unless unless they're emergency calls, but there's a particular way to that you know I'm contacted for that. And I think that this is like one of the first points that I want to bring up. There's always going to be a temptation to like work harder, to like have a higher what place in like the rat race of like making more, of being whatever, of like getting that promotion, that sort of thing. But for me, it's a question of like, well, what constitutes my happiness and my flourishing as a human being? Is it being promoted and getting more money? Maybe that contributes. I'm not going to say never. Like, sure. Okay, fine. But like ultimately, or is it is it living a life that's that's balanced? Um, and I think in this conversation, the work-life balance is we have to acknowledge or we should be more willing to acknowledge the fact that our workday has boundaries. Like we should not be working during our lunch hour. And when we go home, the workday is over unless you're getting paid for it. Unless you're getting paid for it. There's this like there's this. And even then. Yeah, I know. Do you yeah. really need to be putting in the extra Correct. hours? Yeah. There's this woman on Instagram and she has these reels and I don't know her name or her handle, so I couldn't tell you, but it's it's like this kind of workplace, like it's like kind of this ironic, sat, satirical kind of thing. And um, this, uh, she always has these things where like, she's like the work day ends, like I start work at nine and I end work at five and I get an hour off and that's kind of, and like I'm not working extra unless like I'm compensated extra, you know, like that sort of thing. And it's like, I think we ought to be more willing to say that. I don't think the working like 80 hour week an 80 hour work week is a healthy or a good thing. And I think we'll talk this about this too, and I'll stop my rant, but like the, the sort of blending of personal life and work life, whereas like, am I at work right now? I'm at home, but I'm working or I'm at work. But like, I think those are, I think those things should be separate. We should live. They should be separate worlds in which we engage. Yeah. Father Jacob Bertrand. Father Gregory. A Dominican, a Franciscan, a Jesuit walk into a bar. One of them asks the audience to subscribe. That's not a joke. Uh, any ways you can improve upon it? Just don't tell jokes. Right. This is not a joke. Please subscribe. Cheers.